Vandiyadeva's mind was troubled as to how that heroic Vaishnava had come there and why. But he didn't show it. What's the joke? I thought of you just a moment ago. You look up and you're jumping up and down. They say the god who gives gives and gives with the roof, and that's right. He said. Father. Did you think of me just a moment ago? Why should you think of this mortal? Even thinking of Sakshad Ramaparan is useful. They should put sugar in their mouths. At first I thought of Ramaparan. When I came here, I saw the Rameshwara Gopuram in the sea. I thought that Rama worshipped Shiva there and got rid of the sin of killing Ravana. Stop, brother. Stop. Can't stand, Swami. I can't stand. Walking, standing, standing, my feet are begging. You two have mercy and sit down. Then I thought of Rama. Immediately I remembered about Anumar, the devotee of Rama. When I thought about Anumar, they remembered. Immediately you see, you yourself have arrived. Did you just jump across the wall, or did you jump across the ocean like Anumar? Where is Anumar? the great pious brother. Where is my servant? Anumar came to Sri Lanka and killed giants like Akshay Kumar. I could not guide a vile cat. Look! How a cat has given birth to my legs and made bloody wounds! All Workadian pointed to the wounds on his legs. Damn! Did this happen? But why did they go to fight with a nasty cat? I didn't go to the fight. That's what brought me to the fight. How is that, my lord? I came looking for you. I tricked the gatekeepers and jumped over the backyard wall. Down there the cat was reaching for my foot. My foot just touched its tail. But the wicked cat started attacking me with its claws. Brother! What I'm saying? Listen! Even if you fight with a tiger, you can fight, even if you fight with a female, you can fight, you can only fight with a cat. Swami. Now I know that secret. What secret? That cat came here to my room. It stroked my forehead with its tail. It played with me. It didn't bite me. It only attacked you. What is the reason for that? It is a heroic Siva cat that does not like seeing Vaishnavas. Oko. Really? I didn't think of this idea. If I had known it was a heroic vegetarian cat, I would have been able to do four treaches with a stick. You had better not have a rod in your hand. For even in my body heroic Siva blood has begun to boil ever since I came to this field. The knife in my sheath cries out for heroic Vaishnava blood. Dad! I didn't do you any favors. Vaishnava! Didn't you tell me about their sister, the younger queen of Pavur? Yes, I told you. When Ila Iarani of Bhavur went near Kadampur in the closed Palak, the curtain was removed, didn't you point out that God is to me then? Yes, yes so what? I tell you, I saw the same palanquin as it was passing near the Tanjore fort. The palanquin bearers came deliberately and knocked over my horse. I drew back the curtain of the palanquin to demand justice. Who was inside? Pavur Ila Iarani Sakshad is Nandini Devi. Oh! You're lucky! I couldn't see Nandini even if I tried. You've got it! That's how luck comes automatically. After! I told them their names. I told them that they had sent an important message to Devi. I've seen it too. I've never seen a liar like you anywhere in this universe. Oh Vaishnava! My forefathers are the most beloved of poets. They themselves have sung poems. So what? Poet blood runs through my body too. So sometimes imagination runs rampant. Layman like you would say it's a lie. Good, then what happened? Amazed at my imagination, Nandini Devi gave me the signet ring of Palyavur. She asked me to come and see it in the palace. Did you go and see? Wouldn't you have seen it later? I immediately went and saw it. Nandini Devi, who had heard about my heroic deeds, gave me an important job. What job is that? In this Sri Lanka, 
there are the crown jewels and Indra Mela of the Madurai Pandya dynasty. The royal family of Sri Lanka has hidden them in the mountains. Find those jewels somehow and bring them back. He said and sent it. I did not know that it was such a difficult job. It is said that the jewels in the treasure of the great Pula Vetare are as heavy as a pack of a thousand donkeys. That would not be enough for the young queen. What did she say she would give you if you brought her? He said he would wrest the guard of the Tanjore fort from the petty officer and give it to me. Brother! Brother! If you get the guard of the Tanjore fort, can't I enter the fort unhindered? That's beautiful! How can I get Tanjore fort guard? Am I the only one who came to this town and got caught like this? Vandiyadevan said in a very sad voice. Why are you caught? Do you know why you've been imprisoned? All Workadian asked. I brought with me the signet ring given to me by the Queen of Pavur. I thought it would have influence here too. Is that what went wrong? That's a mistake, brother, a big mistake. Isn't the commander Kajumbalar a great velar here? Don't you know that there is great enmity between the Palyavar dynasty and the Kajumbalar dynasty? I got caught unawares. I don't know what I'm doing. Brother. Don't you worry. Don't worry. I'm here to set you free. Oko. I once asked you for a favor, you refused. Yet I have come to help you. Rise with me. Escape from this prison this instant. Vaishnavas. Get out of here quickly. Why, father? The knife in my sheath has begun to wail more and more. It calls for the blood of a valiant Vaishnava. If you ask, let me ask. I have the blood I need. If your knife needs it, eat some and leave. Get up and come with me. No, I can't come. What's the reason? I'm falling asleep with my eyes closed. I haven't slept at night for days. I'm determined to get a good night's sleep today. That's why I even threw the cat away. Brother. What are you saying like this? Is this how you are going to fulfill the thing that you promised to Kundave Devi, the younger bratty? Didn't you agree that you will travel day and night without seeing this leaf until you get this leaf into the hands of Pani's Selvan? Saying this all were Kadi and took the leaf from his lap and gave it to Vandiyadeva. Vandiyathevan eagerly bought it. Until now, he had thought that Alwar Kadayan was trying to trick and deceive him. Now that thought has changed. How did you get this leaf? He asked. Senadhapati Vikramaksari gave it to me. He asked me to return this Pavur palm tree. He said that you can leave whenever you want. O oh Vaishnavas! My sincere thanks to you. Keep all the thanks together. You can give them when the time comes. Sir. Do you know where the prince is at present? No one knows that. He has gone to the hill country from Anuradhapura. We must search and find him. The commander has ordered me to go with you as a guide. I will come if you wish. Vandiyadevan again had some doubts. Sir. May I see the general before leaving? He asked. We must see we must leave after seeing. Why not inform the general about Goddess Vanati? All Workadians said. Hearing this, Vandiyadevan was amazed that this heroic Vaishnava really had the magic trick.